and takeaways and any other cool words starting with T so you can advance your business online the kingdom way. Welcome your host, Christopher Harold. Hey, hey, what's up everybody? Christopher Harold here for another amazing episode of the Kingdom Marketing Secrets Podcast. Guys, this is episode 46. So welcome, welcome, welcome to my domain. I'm glad you guys are here today. If you're feeling good, go ahead and just say, yeah, yeah, even though I can't hear you, but go ahead and say it anyway. But hey, guys, welcome to another awesome and fantastic day that the Lord has given us. And today's episode, I'm really excited to share with you today. It's going to be a really awesome episode. And uh, hey, I'm going to dive into the 10 rules for jumbo success with ads not just not just success not just teeny tiny but to my big old jumbo success guys and i'm really excited to share this with you today so hey this is your first time checking me out show your boy some love by uh subscribing to this podcast leave a review as well and share it with others as well guys and always look at the show notes for more uh powerful content to help you grow your business as well and so and really quick, before I dive into today's episode, uh, I want to make a quick announcement. As many of you might have heard by now, a couple of months ago, I started something called a Money and Marketing Masterclass. And I really had no idea what was going to come out of this thing. You know, I was trying something just as a beta group, you know, something brand new. And my goodness, have God really, really shown out in this masterclass. I mean the growth of it, the demand of it, just the lives that have been transformed has blown my mind. I did not expect this. I had no idea. I knew something great could come out of it, but until you kind of do it, you really don't really know. Well, my goodness, <laughs> the testimonials, the case studies, the, the, just the results from this has just literally transformed so many Christ and kingdom entrepreneurs lives and businesses and the demand for it has been really insane and so I decided to do a new master class for the month of July and 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 you can go and register right now ASAP do not delay because the demand for this literally people inbox me on Facebook said I hate I miss your master class I heard so much about it I hate I miss it please let me know the next one is coming please let me know please let me know please let me know well I'm letting you and the whole world know right now that you can go and roll for the July money and marketing master class right now simply by going to money and marketing masterclass.com how easy is that? Register ASAP. Do not delay. And because, I mean, it's just amazing the, the testimonials come from this. I mean, literally one session. I can guarantee you this. After day one session, your life will never be the same. It's been proven over and over and over and over. And there is no other place that I've seen. There are so many transformations taking place for Christ in the kingdom entrepreneurs. I have. I mean, and here's, here's the crazy thing. It's not just for. Christian entrepreneurs, the business owners, salespeople. The last one we did, we had a Muslim in it. We, we've had people who are, may not even be devoted believers because why? The, the, what's been happening with our community 
and the word is getting out is this, this thing is transformational because with the content you're going to get from marketing with the content you're going to get from money and wealth strategies with all these other strategies you're going to get on how to be able to uh, create so many new income streams in your business and on top of that the does unflappable kingdom principles that are taught here and the foundation here with the strategies with the minds i mean just everything with with the strategic mind behind it guys i'm telling you it's god sent so this is attracting people from all kinds of beliefs all kinds of faiths all kinds of thought patterns philosophies they are coming to the money and market master class in my experience i've never seen any other master class or challenge that is doing what this is doing and i've been a part of quite a few kingdom related christian related and none i have not seen any other master class or challenge that comes close to what we have here and so i encourage you to go join right now go to money and marketing masterclass.com registration is open right now it won't be for very long because once we kick this thing off in july and you're not in you're going to be regretting it that's all i can say all right so go and register right now and so let's talk about the 10 rules for jumbo success with ads now um I highly encourage you to study the life of a fella by the name of P.T. Barnum. Don't know if you're familiar with him, but maybe you heard of Barnum and Bailey Circus. If so, say yes, I have or comment below or <laughs> just say yes, I have. Right. Well, here's the deal. If you saw that movie called The Greatest Showman, his life was way more than that. And this guy was a, a successful entrepreneur, philanthropist. Uh, entertainer. I mean, of course, we, we you hear about you know the sh showmanship that he did and everything like that. But but what I'm telling you is that you want to see the you want to study his life, his biography, because what I'm about to share with you has been inspired from me studying his life and biography from different books and things out there, and and it's so rich, it's so rich in powerful content, and it's so relevant. And so I'm going to share with you those ten rules that I put together. Uh, from this compiling stuff I've seen from his studies and other books. And because this guy was just phenomenal with it. He was the greatest uh, entrepreneur showman of his time in the 1800s. Just the greatest. And and if you apply some of these techniques today, it will radically change your business as well. And so, so um, 10 rules for jumbo success with ads. And when I talk about ads, as you know, I got a, a, a hit song out there called Run Those Ads. If you want to grow your business fast, you know, you're going to find it on YouTube or you may see it uh, going viral on Facebook, right? But the point is this, my friend. P.T. Barnum was a avid supporter of advertising. That's how his business just skyrocketed and blew up. And if you're not running ads, you are doing yourself and your potential clients and customers a huge disservice. You can only do so much from organic and free strategies. And I teach a lot of this stuff in, in the master class as well. Free and paid strategies you could use. But advertising is one of my favorite. Paid ads are one of my favorite. Obviously one of P.T. Barnum's as well. So I'm going to read you, I'm gonna read you this quote that he said. He said, ads is to a genuine article what manure is to land. It largely increases the product. Think about that for a minute. When you run ads, it, it gives you 10, 20, 30, 100 times, 500 times more the exposure. It largely increases your product and service and puts it in front of more and more people. And it can do this while you are asleep, while you're with your family, while you're doing other things that you cannot do the other way. So he understood this in the 1800s, my friend, that you have to, that it's like, it's a genuine, ads is to a genuine article or a, uh, now, article, they couldn't mean back in those days, they do a lot of writing article, but adds to a genuine video, adds to a genuine product or service, right? What manure is to land. What does manure do to land? It largely increases it, right? It makes it more fertile. It makes it more productive. And so the same thing happen with your ads, all right? So, so um, if you need help, and I'm going to say this too. If you need help with your ads and funnels, I'm, I'm talking about a lot of strategies on Facebook ads and maybe some YouTube ads. If you need help in that area, contact our office. Let's go to uh, workwithchrisherald.com and contact our office and see about uh, you know what it takes for you to get set up with our service to help you get your ads and funnels set up. Let's go to workwithchrisherald.com for that, workwithchrisherald.com. All right, go there. Now, let's go ahead and dive into this. One of the rules now, 
it was a lot of different things, but I, I, I kind of confined these and put my own little twist on these. So I wrote them down on my little pad here. So one of the rules here is being unique. Now, one thing I would say about being unique, that's something that uh, stand, makes you stand out. As you know, I have a lot of music marketing videos out there. I have, uh, I've done ads where I've been at track, been on the school tracks, act like I'm doing a relay. Um, I've done ads, you know, I got a, I'll talk about this in a minute, but one of my pages, I'm, I'm in my Superman costume, right? Um, playing basketball, uh, playing golf. I mean, I have so many different types of ads because why? You have to be unique. If you're going to stand out from the competition and it's a very, very crowded, noisy space out there, right? You know, you got to know how to get people attention. You know, there's a phrase in in, 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 the, in the copy world, in the marketing and advertising world called AIDA, attention, interest, desire, action. And so, you know, you got to know how to get people attention. And the one way you get people attention is by being unique. I, I, I always ask a lot of my clients and students this. I said, hey, so what that you're in a field where other people are in it? So what? You know, um, I ask them this. What makes you different? See, I challenge a lot of my clients and students to think differently, to be different, because if if you are in a field and, and you have a lot of other people in a similar field, you have to do something to stand out from the crowd. You can't be like everybody else. And so you have to know how to stand out and being unique, you know, and you should have your own unique selling proposition, you know, uh, by knowing how to create an offer. You know, not providing a product or a service, but knowing how to create an offer. I teach this stuff, too, inside our Money and Marketing Masterclass. But there's a difference, a huge difference. You understand what I'm saying? And so what makes you different? What what, what makes you stand out? Why should I do business with you? I ask all my clients and students that. Why should I do business with you? And most of them initially couldn't respond to that. Because they've been trained and conditioned to do what everybody else is doing. But then after being around me for a while, to get access to my training and everything like that and coaching and mentoring, they be like, wow, we find that unique selling proposition they have that makes them different. Literally, I was on a call today with one of my clients, a coaching call, and I said, hey, you need to share this story here in, 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 your, in your marketing. I said, because this is going to attract so many more people to you. It's going to make you stand out from all the big corporations out there. It's going to make you stand out from everybody. I said, because this, this one unique thing about you, nobody else can say. And I said, you say this, it's going to attract 1,000, 10,000, 100,000 more people in your ideal audience to you. So what makes you unique? All right. That's, that's one rule you need to re uh -oh, really deep do a deep dive and figure out what makes you unique, what makes you Stand out. Number two, get attention. I kind of mentioned that too. But there are ways you can get attention. Well, how can you get attention, Chris? I hear you asking me that. Well, here's the deal. You, why is it, but the better question would be, why is it so important to get people attention? Because people have very short attention spans. People have been inundated with so much marketing and advertising, offline, online, TV, radio, internet, wherever, right? Where they can become uh, something we call uh, blind. Like, uh, it used to be something we used to call banner blindness when we used to do a lot of banner ads. And what does that mean? Well, after you using the same banner for so long, people become numb to it. They become blind to it. And you no longer get their attention. So you got to do things to get their attention. Like I said, I... One of my images, I'm in a Superman costume and another one in the Clark Kent. But you can use graphics, you know, uh, layouts, captions, like nice video ads with graphics on top, header and footer. You know, there are tools out there that I use to allow me to do that. And why? It makes it pop and stand out. Like if you look at something on Facebook or YouTube, well, bam, it's going to stand out and pop and be different. Why? Because of the graphics, the fonts, the colors, right? If it's animated or not. Different things like that, they can get people attention is very important because without their attention, you would never get their interest. You can never uh, speak to their desire and they can never take action on whatever it is you're trying to offer them. So you want to use these nice tools to get people attention because people attention span, I think it's, it's, it's getting shorter and shorter by the year, literally by the year. And so. I think it went from people attention span at one time, maybe like 37 seconds. I think today it may be like eight seconds, right? So if you got six to eight seconds to get somebody attention, you better be darn good at getting somebody attention, right? So uh, 
very important that you do that and use these nice tools and graphics. Captions are nice. Why? Because it's words on the screen. 